Hey everyone, Mr. Riley here, and this time I'm in New York City for a new park called Little Island. So come with me as we explore New York City's newest attraction. Rising from the remnants of Pier 54, Little Island sits on a site that has played a pivotal role in the story of the Hudson River and its surrounding communities. So normally we go back in time to the seventh grade curriculum of the 18th and 19th century, but now we're going to the 21st century where we're going to look at a landscape design park, Little Islands. After Superstorm Sandy badly damaged Pier 54, billionaire Barry Dillard, in partnership with the Hudson River Park Trust, envisioned a new type of public space for New York, one that would create a sense of immersive experience with nature and art. So this is a 100% man-made island that's constructed out of concrete. Little Island's distinct exterior is supported by concrete piles. On top of the piles, 132 concrete tulips make up the structure of the park. The plantings are buried to provide an environment that changes with the seasons, with flowing trees and shrubs, fall foliage, and evergreens. So behind me is the Hudson River as it flows south from the Adirondacks, and then eventually you go into New York Harbor and into the Atlantic Ocean. So like Frederick Church, you feel you're part of the landscape when you're walking through here, except this is a more fun and whimsical park than Olana. Lots of plants and flowers incorporated into this urban landscape. Looking south, you see the Freedom Tower, and that's the financial district of New York City. And that's where the original Dutch colony got started back in 1626. All right, historical selfie fans. This is a special edition. We have the entire Riley family and boyfriend of Caroline. So welcome to this special edition of our exploration of the Little Island in New York City. So with us, we have TikTok sensation Grace. What's, your, what's the best part of the uh, Little Island? The grass. The grass part, you heard it first. All right. The theater. The theater is yeah, that's a good one. Alright, the theater. And the bathroom. Oh, the bathroom. What's so good about the what's so neat about the bathroom? Um, so there was uh so you wash your hands, there's soap, you wash your hands, you dry, and then you get the two things that come out, and you dry your hands right there. Alright, and Mike, what's your take on the uh, Alright, so come here for the bathrooms and be sure to take in the whole little islands and enjoy this day in the park. The park is free and open to the public, but you must have reservations that you make online. So in the midst of New York City, in this hectic environment, it's good to find a place where you can relax and get some fresh air. Right, so if you stare at it long enough, you're going to get pretty dizzy. And when you're here at Little Island, you can take the shortcut. Alright, so this 
man-made islands was made in part by a billionaire who created this and for the cost of $280 million. So come down from Carmel and check out New York City and Little Island for yourself. The city's theater, dance, literature, music, art, and cuisine are all reflections of the mixed traditions brought in by millions of immigrants. And the city is a wonderful place for out-of-towners to celebrate birthdays. Happy birthday! Next stop, Hudson Yards, The Edge. What? Historical selfie bonus footage. Oh yeah. Hashtag city. Hashtag Caroline's birthday. Hashtag <laughs> birthday. Everybody go put happy birthday in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> comments aren't allowed on my oh, really? page. What? Oh, you should allow me. No, some graders can be mean. Oh. <laughs> some graders can be mean. So I'm here at the edge at the Hudson Yards. So you gotta go check it out. I'm on the 104th floor. So you get the whole view of Manhattan. Alright, so New York City is a city of 8 million people, so this is where cultural diversity started with the Dutch, and it still obviously continues today. This is the selfie paradise, so the edge is where it's at if you want to take selfies non-stop. Alright, so keep living history. <laughs> <laughs>